There's a problem. I have to bother you quickly with a little issue of serialization. When a user logs in, the user entity is stored in the session. For this to work, PHP serializes the user object to a string at the end of the request and stores it. At the beginning of the request, the string is unserialized and turned back into the user object. This is great, and it's obviously working great. We're surfing around as Wayne the admin, but there's a gotcha in Doctrine. Sometimes, Doctrine will stick some extra information onto our entity, like the Entity Manager, that big important object we use to save things. Normally we don't care about this, but when the user object is serialized, having that big object hidden in our entity causes serialization to fail. The Entity Manager contains a database connection and other information that just can't be serialized. We need to help Doctrine out. Start by adding the serializable interface to the user class. This core PHP interface has two methods, serialize and unserialize. When the user object is serialized, it'll call the serialize method instead of trying to do it automatically. When the string is deserialized, the unserialize method is called. This may seem odd, but let's just return the ID, username, and password inside an array for serialize. For unserialize, just put those three values back on the object. If you think about it, this should kind of break everything. When Symfony gets the user object from the session and deserializes it, our user will have lost some of its data, like roles and is active. That's not cool. Clearly that's not the case. Symfony's security system is smart enough to take the ID and query for a full fresh copy of the user object on each request. We can see this right in the web debug toolbar. Once a user is logged in, each request has a query that grabs the current user from the database. So we're good.